Oh, this lighting is doing me no favours. But hello everyone, it is Friday night and Jas and I have escaped London. We've just got to Leamington Spa and we've literally just checked into our hotel. There's Jas behind me. Hello. <laughs> our room is actually huge. We're staying in the Premier Inn. We literally have five minutes. We've got like a sofa bed situation thing going on here. And yeah, we're cutting it really fine because we have a table booked at 8.30 but my cousin Serena lives here and we've come to see her for the weekend and just get away from London because I think as of midnight tonight, right? Yep. We're going into tier two of the lockdown stage in London. I actually don't know what tier they're in here. I don't really know what it means. No one really knows. It's no all very confusing. Tears. Yeah, we're all in tears. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it just means that you can't go to other people's houses and you can still meet up to six people outdoors in the restaurant. I don't really know, it's all very confusing. But we just wanted to get away and I love a hotel bed. Although this one doesn't look that great. Do you know what? This bed, I'm not moaning about the hotel already. This one's fine, it's decent. It's actually huge considering it's a city centre hotel. But considering they have all this space, why not put in a bigger bed? This is just like a double. And those are the flattest pillows I have <laughs> ever seen. Looks a bit lumpy, not very well made. But anyway, I just love a hotel bed. Anyway, so we're off to the restaurant now. And then I think we're going to go and see Serena's house because she just lives down the road. We have loads of food for her. She's a student, by the way. So we picked up loads of food from her parents for her mm -hmm. uh, to keep her stocked up for this next tier of lockdown, <laughs> I guess, in her fridge and freezer. Nothing. I'm excited to see her house, though. Hang on, I've got masks. Yep. Well, um, I'm not taking my handbag. Is that right? Yep. So yeah, I'm excited to see her house and well, I'll that's take with me. Oh yeah, a key dress. So can I just say, every time we stay in a hotel, we're like the very last room, so the furthest away from the lift. Yeah. Although the noise wouldn't bother us even if we were right next door. But we just have like, we always have the longest corridors and like windy corridors to walk down. Why do we always get that? Sure, I mean, today we checked in quite late, Probably. at like 8 p.m., but Maybe we don't always check in late. Right? Maybe. <laughs> it's the V, Nishi V. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Such a cute little place. There's, I've seen loads of charity shops. I have this new thing of like popping into charity shops wherever I am, and I always find books that have been on my list to read, so that's what we're doing tomorrow, yeah? Yep. <laughs> So Serena and I are sharing a couple of vegetarian dishes but of course the one I picked has a food warmer thing. If you guys have ever watched my videos before you know how I feel about these things. She hates them. <laughs> so she hates them much. Warmers. So much. <laughs> oh my god. Gas <laughs> went a bit crazy in Tesco. We have a lot sure of drinks. He went to Tesco for soda water. Anyway, I think we're going to get drunk tonight because everything closes at 10, there's nothing you can do. And apparently half of Leamington was in Tesco in the yeah, alcohol yeah, section <laughs> when Jas popped in. Like they obviously come from like pubs and restaurants and yeah, headed straight for the alcohol. Because <laughs> we're in a very basic hotel that doesn't really provide um, huh. an ice bucket. Ice yeah, because someone like ice bucket on the yeah. Morning everyone. How was your sleep? Well, it was really bad. It's terrible here. <laughs> the windows don't open, so stuffy. No, it was cold. Well, no, I was, I was a bit cold when I woke up. Maybe the drinking last night, kind of. I mean, I this. I had half the amount of drinks than everyone else. My cousin, who's a student, can obviously handle her drinks. Yeah, she's a rebel. And so she had like twice as much as me, but I was more tipsy than her because <laughs> I just don't really like drink. Yeah, that she much was shocked. Anymore. She was shocked at you. She was just like, "What? Like, what's wrong with you? I thought you used to drink loads." I was like, "I did. I don't anymore." But she's a student. She's allowed. Um, yeah, it was just I don't know. This place is just like falling apart. Yeah, it's not a premier. Can I just show you? You wouldn't say it's a premier experience. <clears throat> What are those things called? Actually, have I got it here, that silver thing? You know these like little things you get on Ikea furniture? They're quite sharp. Oh, yeah, it's like screw wood together. <laughs> I nearly stepped on it yesterday with my oh, socks. It's actually coming off, isn't it? Yeah, basically the table's broken. The lamp, every time you put something on the table, the lamp, like the bulb like jitters. <laughs> 
<laughs> the chair looks like it's going to fall apart if you sit on it. There's like a few screws loose in this bed thing. It's just, what did I, what did I tweeted yesterday? So staying in a premiere in this weekend, <laughs> nothing is premiere but the price <laughs> and location. Because like, what is this? Anyway, we're going to go for breakfast because we're both hungry. Yep. We're just hungry, am I right? Yeah, I've been awake for ages. Yeah, I haven't. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's oh, yeah, that's so good. Oh yes, look at this. How are you doing? You're on a very bad day, aren't you, today? And it's only just begun. She burnt her tongue. <laughs> I love places like this. Like, it's Wagamama, but you wouldn't know because they haven't got their own branding. And all the buildings here look really cute. This road is called Regency Parade, I think. It's basically the main high street in Leamington. We just spent the morning wandering around charity shops, which was really nice. I went into a few interior shops because they've got some like independent ones here. But now we're off to go and pick up Serena because she has some work to do this morning. In fact, we might, oh, what am I doing? Got confused. In fact, we might also go and check out her house, which I'm really excited to see because I never lived at a house at uni and I always find the concept really like really cool. We're off to go pick Serena up and I've just messaged her to ask if we can go and see inside her house. Um she may not let us, which is fine. But I really want to see her house because I find the concept of living in a house at uni really cool. I know my sister did when she was at uni, but I never did because I was at uni in central London and of course like why would you stay in a house? But I just think that's so cool to have like a living room and like actual space. So yeah. I'm dying for a coffee actually. I ordered a mocha at breakfast and obviously I can't, I mean I don't drink a coffee when it's really hot. So I waited until I finished my breakfast, took a sip and I was like this is hot chocolate. And the guy was adamant it was a mocha and I was like no I think it's a hot chocolate. And then I got Jas to try it and he's like there's no coffee in it, it's a hot chocolate. And so then he was like oh i'm happy to make it again but i'd already asked him loads of questions at this point i think i'd annoyed him so i was like oh yeah if you don't mind and then he asked like the woman to make it again and we both heard him say make sure it's a mocha with oat milk like a million times and then it was far too hot for me to hold because i got in takeaway cup and, but, yeah, <laughs> and, <I'm done. laughs> and jeff was laughing so i had to backwash my coffee and spit it back out <laughs> but it's fine it's my coffee <laughs> Anyway, by the time I finally got to drink it, it was hot chocolate again. Oh my god. So I haven't had a coffee. Maybe that's why they make the mockers. It was just not very nice. This is why, like, I know everyone always says, like, go to the independent places for coffee, but nine times out of ten, I'm just disappointed, and that's why I just stick with Starbucks, because you know what you're getting, unless you get really shitty, like, barista. Dinner last night, by the way, I forgot to say, yep. at that place called Sabai Sabai was so good. It was nice, but it's the smaller portions that we're used to. Yeah, portions were on the small side. Because, uh, like, let's say chicken satay, I normally get chicken satay, and you always, always got four skewers in any restaurant I went to. Mm. This one gives you three. And their London prices are not like cheaper because we're not in London. Um, and even, but it was the best Thai food I've ever had. Yeah, it's lovely. Um, I have to admit, it was nice for what it was. Like, it was tasty, and uh, I did find it nice, but portions, like, you know. Yeah. Oh my god. This is like the meze of dreams, isn't it? What did we even order? This is Serena, have you been in my vlog yet? I don't think I have. <laughs> no, I don't think you have. I haven't really vlogged much, but um, we're now having lunch. This is a falafel flatbread. Mm. This is like a main, and we've got two sides. Kalumi fries and, oh, these are roast potatoes coated in olive tapenade with pecorino cheese over the top. How incredible does this sound? It smells so good. <laughs> shop is so cool. I want to buy everything in here. We're bored. Yeah, we're in TK Maxx and we're bored. <laughs> we literally just sat here. We don't know what to do. There's nothing we want to buy. 
and it's quite nice to sit down really. And relax. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's really big to your face. Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we're in TK Maxx. We had a coffee before lunch. But now is when I would usually have a coffee after lunch. But I can't have another one. I want a nice, refreshing, cold drink. And I keep saying that to these two, and they're just like, water? <laughs> I just mean like, not necessarily with ice. It's a nice drink, it's not a hot drink. <clears throat> like a peach iced tea. Hmm. Hmm. My hair is very frizzy. They're really comfy seats. Yeah, well, I've sat down too. What are you doing? The board. <laughs> it's that weird time of day where it's the shops are about to close. Yeah. We can't have dinner anytime soon, and there's just nothing to do. And it's a post lunch, guys. So we either sit here and we sit in our hotel room or we sit in the car. <laughs> and we can just sit here while it's open. <laughs> yeah. Watch, like it's an airport. That's what it looks like you're doing, people watching at the moment. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Quite empty, really, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so you're now sat on different chairs. Some blue ones. Testing About testing every single chair. They were looking at, yeah, they're looking at these little yellow ones. This one. That's cool. Where are you gonna be sitting next? In the next. <laughs> On the Crazy. stairs. Cheese there. That's like I get the hazelnut latte flavour tea. It's so good. We've got um hazelnut latte flavour tea with oat milk, chewy tapioca balls, and chocolate popping balls. Really good. We're in a place called Tea Society. What have you got? No, I got last one and it's really nice. Mm. Um, and they have a pool table. Like I used to love playing pool. Um, my sister and I grew up with a pool table at home, and so we were pretty good. I would say. It's been years, like, you never see pool tables anywhere anymore. Um, so we've just been playing pool, having our tea, and it's great. Look at them. Finally got my cold drink. <laughs> like four hours later. <laughs> cheese and onion <laughs> and your mint arrow your face mask <laughs> and hand gel and I'm gonna do a yogurt coated cranberries <laughs> yum <laughs> sorry I'm right in your face <laughs> look at our hotel I swear I think it's falling apart you have to like stick your finger <laughs> into <laughs> the gap <laughs> what are you no, no. quick <laughs> No, I'm not even drunk. <laughs> um, sanitizer? Oh, they blank. Oh, it's so annoying. They're like, yeah, it's not a very good impression when you first check in. We were like, is this place like falling apart? We're gonna be stuck in the lift. Sanitizer? This one stinks. Well, what are you trying to do? Oh, just wait. drop it on the floor. Just drop it. On the floor. <laughs> <laughs> what on our feet? I forgot I brought some face masks with me. We're back in the hotel room just having like a few drinks. We've got a bottle of JD from yesterday. 
we bought and a bottle of coke but it's like warm <laughs> anyway yeah i bought these face masks with me i carry these everywhere and we always <laughs> forget to do them i've had them for so long this is like one set it's just an old one but i think we're all going to do the same one it's a llama oh. face mask infused with illuminating 24 karat gold it's from the creme shop a korean brand i'll just hit this one home for another day but yeah, we're finally doing these after like so long of just talking about it. Yeah, true. <laughs> this one's a bit different to regular sheet masks. It says you're meant to feel a tingling effect, which is very interesting. And also, fun fact, female llamas will spit at male llamas to show that they're not interested. Maybe we should start doing that yeah, to men. <laughs> just spit at them. It's yeah, fine. That's just <laughs> Especially in COVID time. I think that's <laughs> These don't look quite as funny as the tiger because it's just grey as opposed to orange. But yeah, no, put this thing on a stick on my chin because I think I've got. Hair. We're just saying they don't really feel very tingly, but they're very juicy, aren't they? Yeah, they've got a lot. Feels very of nice. Like we feel like loads all over our arms, like the excess, but there's still like lo loads left. But yeah, here we go. Like I don't think I've ever stayed in a hotel and not done a sheet mask. I just always have so many just to use up, and it's not the sort of thing I ever make time for at home, which is a bit of a faff. Because <laughs> I don't always feel like I do something, like something that, really. So I just do them in hotels. <laughs> you, got you know it's got that moustache? You look like that, that um... You, look, you guys look so funny. <laughs> That's literally funny. I look like a zombie. Good morning. Um, it's Sunday today. We're pretty much ready to check out a lot earlier than we need to be, which never really happens, but it just goes to show how crap this hotel is. In fact, this morning, Jas woke me up because our bathroom is leaking from the lights in the ceiling. Let me show you. Do you have the light on, Jas? Yeah. You'll be able to see, but there's spotlights in the mirror. Yeah. Like, so they're dripping water, and it's like falling there and like into the toilet, and like, it's just all just wet and horrible. I don't know if you'll be able to see. No? Yeah. Just look at that, both lights are leaking. <laughs> like... So we didn't want to tell them because they'd kick us out of our room and like we wouldn't be able to get ready and stuff. So anyway, we're going to check out a bit earlier. And I feel really like, not hungover, but just... It's horrible when you've been like drinking the night before like we're up till 2 30 in the morning again both nights we've been up till 2 30 in the morning with serena drinking she's drank way more than either of us both nights and she's been completely sober and like just been a bit tipsy but i've just been like wasted because i just don't really drink anymore and obviously she's a student and like she's just used to drinking loads all the time that's what i was like anyway i saw somebody on instagram a few days ago put black eyeliner on their waterline and the like the same pencil to line their eyelid so i wanted to do the same today I haven't done this for years but thought i'd switch up my look <laughs> anyway i think jess has found a pub that does a vegan and vegetarian roast but um they're fully booked but he said if you walk in you might get lucky so we're gonna go there because i've like i'm always craving like a vegetarian roast dinner and there's nowhere near us that does it and so we said we'd try and find one today and i think we have so we're gonna go pick serena up in a bit and then go for lunch and then end the vlog like this has been a really fun weekend in leamington hasn't it like we haven't really done much like touristy things because i mean a covid nothing's really open b it's leamington there's nothing to actually do apart from a big park which is nice on a sunny day not on a gloomy day yeah there's jefferson park i think that's what it's called and i take you to work castle if you walk through it yeah, all right. You're just repeating what Serena said yesterday. Well, well so I got to know a bit of history. <sighs> Wait a minute. Yeah, okay, Paul. She won by fluke, by the way. I did not. I, I, we plus, love Serena. Plus, our snooker table was a little bit wonky. What's that yeah. going to do? That's still one. Yeah, well, that's the thing, isn't it? Okay. You, anyway, let's yeah, go. you won because you got a wonky shot, so that, that corrected it. <laughs> A wonky and a, a minus and a minus is a plus, isn't it, right? Just, just don't be a sore loser, just rest <laughs> me. Anyway, we have to go now, goodbye. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so excited. Thank you. So good. Oh, it looks amazing. Look at the size of my Yorkie. Yeah. 
How cute is this? The receipt comes in like a little Mr. Messy book. It's like it was designed for you. Thanks. Mr. Hey, your mask matches your jumper. <laughs> Lunch was really good. We went to a place called the drawing room, just there. Very happy with our veggie roast and the chicken really one good. that Jas had. We're leaving Leonington now after we dropped Serena home. Don't get emotional. Sad time. <laughs> <laughs> it's been such a nice weekend though, hasn't it? Yep, it's been really good. But anyway, I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon with a new video. Bye! Say bye Serena! Bye! <laughs> Can they see me? Yeah! <laughs> bye Jas! Bye.